Hi everyone, you guys have frequently been asking how do I get the same UI? Can you link your LVUI profile? What WeCoras do I use? And of course, which add-ons I use? Well, as you guys can already guess in this video, I will go through my favorite add-ons, which LVUI profiles I like the most, and how I find the best WeCoras for each class and spec. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. This way you can watch my new uploaded videos right away. Let's start with the base of our UI, which is a combination of LVY and weak auras. Be sure to download them because you need them to get the same UI as I have. For the people that have no idea what I'm talking about, go check out my other UI video first, where I show you how you install LVY and weak auras, and how you import profiles from wago.io. This is very important, so please go check out that video first, and then continue watching this one. Okay, when you have the latest version of LVY and weak auras, then the rest of the steps are fairly easy. In the video description you will see a bunch of links, but for now we only want to take the LVY profiles because they will form the foundation of our UI. So click on the LVY profile links, once on the website choose which one of the two you enjoy the most, copy it to clipboard and get into WOW. I will do this one with you guys on a character that has a really messy UI. Okay, once we have logged in, hit escape, click on LVUI, click on profiles, click on import profile. Should you already have imported an LVUI profile, go to existing profiles and click on the one you have chosen. And voila! When that's done, import a weak aura that I really love. A link is in the description as well. This will implement a custom cast bar. You guys know the drill, copy the string and import it. The string is called casting bar 8.0. Click it and move it into position of your choice. Okay, now we don't want to have two player cast bars on our screen as we only want to see our imported cast bar. The solution is very easy. Simply go through the LVY options menu, click on unit frames, player frames next and click on cast bar and uncheck enable. When that's done, we can start by positioning our class and spec specific weak auras that you imported from any of the links in the video's description. That is again very easy, especially when you have chosen a weak aura string that contains one for each spec within the same class. So yeah, open weak auras, import the string, if you haven't done this already. Click on the string and move it into place. There we go, super easy. Now last thing you want to do is setting up your key bindings by typing slash KB. And the biggest part of your customized user interface is done. Now we'll go over some core add-ons I use and you should also use, especially when you're into raiding and mythic pluses. Okay, first is angry assignments. This add-on is meant for raiding, and this way your raid leader can put some handy notes on the screen that everyone in the raid is able to read. Like for example, group 1 soaks first and then group 3 soaks second. It's very handy. Next is details damage meter, more detail than Skada, and a little bit complicator, but once you get the hang of it, you're good to go. I also really like gotta go fast, now I know Blizzard implemented kind of the same thing, but I still feel like this one is much better. It basically shows time left on a Mythic Plus, how much time left for a plus 3, plus 2 or plus 1 chest, and how much percentage you have and what affixes are active. Ah, Raider IO. If you want to get into Mythic Plus's group faster, then get Raider IO and go to their website to link your characters so you can get started with your Mythic Plus core. You can also get Simcraft and Pawn, Basically add-ons to sim yourself and then Pawn will show you which items in your bags are potential upgrades. But I'm old fashioned so I just switch my gear and sim with raid bots or simulation crafts. Last but not least, deadly boss mods for obvious reasons. And that's it for this video. As you can see, I try to keep things as simple as possible. That's why I use LVY profiles from other people and for weak auras I look for the current best ones by rating them by date and stars. In terms of add-ons, I don't go too crazy. I hope most of you are now happy with the same looking UI. Should you have any questions, put them in the comment section down below and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible. Like the video if you liked it and of course don't forget to subscribe to the channel. For the people that are already subscribed, click on the bell icon and join the notification squad. Enjoy your new looking UI and I see you guys next time.